Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is The Florence and if it's your first time on here, hello. But if you're a returning subscriber, I love you. Yeah, so in today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys. I'll be sharing my I'll be sharing 10 feminine hygiene tips with you guys that things I've been doing for over 10 years or for the past 10 years, things I've been doing like to keep myself neat and to smell and feel good. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. If you see me looking down, as usual, I wrote down things to be more articulate while talking to you guys. Yeah, so the first on my list is brush your teeth at least twice a day. I don't know, in this 21st century, in 2021, some people still don't brush their teeth. Some people still have mouth odor. Why? Why, sis? What are you doing? Why are you sleeping on yourself? Brush your teeth at least twice a day because if you can't brush twice, twice a day, I would advise you to use mouthwash. I actually ran out of some of my stuff, so I would place pictures up on the screen for you guys to like get them if you are interested in getting the products I use for myself so I advise you to brush your teeth at least twice a day number two bathe at least twice a day <laughs> it's shocking like it's so absurd that some people still bathe only once a day and sleep comfortably how you will try to bathe at least twice a day because why I use this sorry I use this sponge you know this hand exfoliating sponge let me get the new one yeah this one i still have an extra pack so i use it like because i feel like it gets everywhere it, it gets everywhere like it gets everywhere so that's why i use it. and i also recommend it for anyone still using so number three this is a mistake I know most people make, like, even if you are shy to say, don't be shy, don't be shy. Even if you are shy to say, this is a mistake most people make, like, while wiping their, what maybe, let's say I, I use the toilet, I use the bathroom, I use the toilet, and maybe I went to pee or do the extra thing, the other thing, they wipe back to front, like, you know, I don't know how I can give this example. Let's say this is my this purse is a leg, it's my like my leg, and this the you know your where your cookie jar is located and your butt is located. People wipe like this is the this is the cookie jar and this is your butt. People wipe their butt front to the cookie jar. That's wrong. Don't do that. Don't do that. That's your butt. You sweat. I sweat. Everybody sweats. So you don't want to be bringing everything from the back to the front. Take, like, from today now, start doing front to back. Because I don't even do front to back. I just get my, whenever I'm with maybe sanitary, towel, a tissue, paper, or wipe, baby wipes, I just clean, like, I clean my cookie jar first. Then I get every, whatever is stuck in the cookie jar, I clean out. Then I use another paper or another tissue paper or wipe then clean my butt like i do them differently separately i don't do it at once i don't do it together because i don't know why would you okay. moving on to number four i don't know some people like i know when i was in high school i used to say like just crack joke with my friends i be like i can't like i just exaggerate sometimes i be like i can wear a sanitary towel for like the whole day but yeah people do that we know people do that but don't do that change your sanitary towel at least twice a day or even thre don't wait till it's full <laughs> advice you change your pad at least twice a day this is what i use i use lady care because i kept number five cultivate the habit of cleaning the back of your ears whether with wipes alcohol or soup and water do you know that back of your ear smells do you know it smells so clean it me when i me i do i clean every day when i'm beating like after beating with my toe i have piercings so i i you are supposed to clean your ears yes you're supposed to clean your ears like after beating when you leave the bathroom clean your ears either with wipes like that's why i said this is your best friend it out with wipes just gets one 
clean the back of your ears do that now do that while watching and you see that you get dead out if you don't nobody wants to be kissing and like you know some guys or some people just have weird sexual what do i call it i don't know they're just weird some people kiss your like some people click on <laughs> So people kiss your ears so and nobody wants to be kissing on a dirty ear like kissing you and maybe taste sand or taste please clean your ears yes don't be a ton off <laughs> so number six shave regularly use i personally use um what's it called vits but i don't have it like i ran out of it before coming back to school and i've not restocked and i've been using razors and all, but since i've been using razors i've not had that shaving stick i've not had any complaints at all no ingrowns no balls no boils no nothing no rashes no nothing strange because it's a personal thing when i use it i dispose it immediately so our advice if you notice anything strange or weird whatever product you're using run for your life run switch <laughs> yeah so that's it if you want if you guys want me to show you guys how i shave my and not get ingrowns comment down below and i'll be willing to do it for you guys okay to the next one number seven i can't believe that some people still smell and people some people have body odds now okay this is number seven use deodorants so one day i entered private no short to not short to keke you know that keke that pep it's a means of transportation in Nigeria. I entered the KK and this guy, hey, he sat beside me and my, I, I kid you not, he was oozing. The smell, hey, Jesus. My, I don't know, let's not just talk about that, but please use deodorant. I'm a girl and I don't like to smell. I don't like people who smell. If you're my friend and you smell, I'll walk up to you and I'll tell you chest to chest. I'll speak to you with my full chest and tell you that you smell or I'll recommend I might not say it to you so you know what your feelings because you know but I'll just tell you that see babe this is how it is I with this if you go like this people running from you just that, that, that. I don't know how to talk to you for me for years I've been using Dove Dove men plus care that's what is on my but I don't know you guys cannot see for years that's what is here dove men get the, make a screenshot right now get go to run to the grocery store get this i have pray you get the point ladies you get the point moving on to number eight some people don't wash their hair and that is is is, 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 is appalling like you know in 2021 some people don't wash their hair do you know that guys are observant a guy can be kissing you now just even me sitting down, sitting down beside someone, she, she already knows the smell of my hair. She already, she can tell if my hair is smelling or is like smelling good or smelling bad. So number four, number eight, wash your hair often. Always keep your hair clean, babies. You know, like for me now, this hair has been on my this braid has been on my hair for three weeks. Okay, the ninth of April, make it right. It, what's this? This it's already one month. So you know. I'm about to wash my hair after this video i'm going to wash my hair because that's the that's the longest i go because i use i use my actually i don't have a perfume that for my hair but i, I spray my perfumes on my hair because like i said i i'm never caught on fresh it's not good to be caught on fresh as a beautiful girl you know? <laughs> so oh, wash your hair regularly yes on to number nine hmm. do you know your vagina can smell that is your cookie jar your cookie jar it smells don't don't be that girl that when she walks into the room everybody knows that hmm or we're trying to like we're trying to hide for cover like we're like she's here don't be that girl i used to know a girl that down there her cookie just smells like rotten eggs so don't be that girl please don't be that girl i know that like i know that if you are in a community like if you are sharing bathrooms over four or five people make it a habit to visit the doctor like the gynecologist check down there make sure it, nothing is going wrong because toilet infection is the worst thing that can happen to a girl like don't do that try like save up money even if you are broke how much five thousand ten thousand 
you go check your body it, which, which one is worse getting the infection or preventing it please don't be that girl that some male stand there so let your vagina breathe what, I'm, what i mean by let your vagina breathe is wearing breathable clothes wearing breathable materials that are light like materials that when you put on you can air can enter like there you get me i don't want to be make, calling the actual name because you know youtube session and all i'm calling this cookie jar so we have things that we have breathable clothes materials that are breathable that air can pass through to your you know your cookie jar so don't let it smell because just imagine going to see your guy or your boyfriend and when you just put off your pants it's like hmm or just say ah, baby i'm no longer in the mood how will you feel so don't be that girl please and i want to add something i used to know a girl that says like when i was in i used to know this girl she'd be like her boyfriend you they use he like he puts ice cream in her you know her cookie jar like just that's some people everybody has crazy different like like i said about the ear licking the ears people just have crazy sexual i don't know what's, what i don't know what to call it sexual you know just to have that some people are just freaky yes let me use that word freaky 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 freakies this girl was telling me that this her guy like when he wants to like you know visit the cookie jar with his mouth <laughs> I like how I just made it look sweet. This is the cookie jar with his mouth, like you know, he wants to uh the cookie jar. He'll he'll get ice cream, strawberry ice cream, and like put there and then don't allow baby, don't do that. It's, you already have bacteria in there. So why do you why do you need no you know you know don't do that? Don't no, don't I don't don't you don't need anything to go in there. She, she will clean it she will clean herself what you need to do is just use warm water use water water can don't even put any disinfectant inside it like i used to use like two weeks ago i was using my disinfectant down there like when i put it in water i use it to rinse then i real i noticed that my my cookie jar was not comfortable with that mixture so i had to stop so don't put anything inside just water warm water I use warm water sometimes like when I just want to like do like environmental sanitation for my cookie jar I use warm water but regular days this I'm rushing to class <laughs> I cannot be boiling anything for anybody so I use normal water down there so your cookie jar can do herself can take care of herself just clean it with water alone you don't need to put ice cream you don't need to put any vagina whatever to make you uh, I said you don't need to put any cookie anything to make it any to make it taste good like people that say ah i'm not I, I usually don't get wet so i want to drink this so i can be wet no baby you don't need it you don't visit the doctor and he'll prescribe one or two for you to do number 10 that's the last one so people still leave their nails like market women i don't know why are you selling up why are you selling vegetables you know those men that sell vegetable in the market, how their fingers are, like their nose, their nose are. This is 2021, baby. You don't need to be, you don't need to be looking ashy. <laughs> Why? Why will you be looking ashy at this stage? It's critical, though. It's critical. See, men, yeah, men, are, men are natural nails. That's fine. Just make sure it's neat. Clean it regularly. I fix nails and we know, eh, that... Some people we in Nigerians we eat eba with with most 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 people eat eba with their hands. You wash down there with your hands. You I don't even advise fixing nails because some people when they take eba eat eba with their nails, they still they don't they, they, they not everybody knows how to clean inside of their nails. So they use this hand, they used to eat eba. The residue will be in the fingernails. Then they will still wash the cookie jar with hey my sister, my sister, come close. Don't do that again. Baby, why is no. it that? Why? If you are going to use, when you, whenever you fix your nails, use fork to eat eba. Don't use your nails. If you know you cannot enjoy eba with nail with fork, then I don't know what to do. Don't fix nails. Don't fix nails. Then still use or just make it a habit to always clean your nails, clean the inside of your nails for those fixing nails or those with natural long nails. So I know you get the point already. So. That's all the tips I have for you guys.
Oh, oh, oh.